another Router Gods video. My name is Humphrey Chung, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to speed up your binary and decimal conversions, which is very important for subnetting. And we're going to do that by playing around with Cisco's binary game. And this is a very cool game. You can easily find it by going to Google and search for Cisco binary game. And uh, it'll probably be the first link there. And this is the binary game, Cisco binary game. And we'll start it. Now, it looks kind of confusing when you first start, but it simply is this. You'll see at the top and bottom, you've got the very familiar binary numbers of 128, 64, 32, so on and so forth. You've got these large zeros and ones, so these are binary numbers right here. And then you might have a decimal number here. So here's how it goes. If you have a decimal number here, that is 34, what you're going to do is you're going to click on these digits right here and you're going to add them up to where they equal 34. So what Cisco does is they sometimes click in the wrong one. So right here you can see one is selected for two. So this is equal to the number two. I'm gonna unselect that, that's going to make it zero. So for me to get to 34, I need to do 32 and two. 32 plus two is 34, so I'm gonna click 32, and then I'm gonna click on two, okay? Now, in this particular problem, this is another kind of a problem they'll ask you, is this box is blank. That box is blank. And so what they want you to do here is put in the decimal representation of the numbers that are selected on the left-hand side. So what you can see here is all, all these are zeros except for the one above two. So the number we want is two. So we'll just go over here, type in the number two, and enter, okay? So let's continue on. Here we've got a blank box, so they're asking us to type in a decimal number. We've got the one selected here, that's all. So we're going to click in that box, type in one, and enter. Here we've got the number eight already typed in, so they are telling us we have to make this add up to eight. And they've made this incorrect by having 16 selected, so we're going to uncheck that, unselect it, and click the one that's above the eight. Don't worry guys, if this seems too simple, it's going to get a little bit harder. So here we've got the number 34. They've been helpful. They've popped in 32 for us right there. We just need to have two more and we're done there. Now this is interesting, 127. How do I get that really quickly? Well, you could fumble around and do stuff, but you'll notice that 127 is just one below 128. So if it's just one number below any of these numbers, all you have to do is select all the numbers after that and you get that number okay here we've got the number 16 of course Cisco selects the wrong ones and we simply click the one above 16 here the one is above the two so this is two here we've got 192 so we're gonna uncheck the one above eight we start off with 128 128 plus 64 is 192 and we're good there and now you can see they're getting a little bit more complicated. They're selecting two numbers, and eventually they'll select multiple numbers and spread them apart. Here we've got a number over eight and four, so that's going to be a 12. And here we have a number over 32, so that's gonna be obviously a 32. Okay, now it gets a little interesting, 240. Well, 240 is 128 plus 64, that gives us 192, 192 plus 32 gives us 224, 224 plus 16 gives us 240. So it's the first four binary bits selected to one. Here we've got the ever familiar two right there. That's not a problem. 12 right here, four is selected. We just add an eight to it. And you could basically see how it's supposed to go. So these things will come up faster. They'll get more complicated, but you pretty much get what's going on here. Very simple game, but it's fun and it really helps you with your binary stuff. So next video we'll take a look at subnetting and how to speed up your subnetting. Thanks for watching.